come back this afternoon. Get some shooting. Hey, Hops. Hey, Hops. Hops and Lewis film. Are you up here? Hey. Everybody else is up, getting up and ready. Well, good morning. What an adventure we are on today. We're uh, Southern Utah, a little honey hole they call the Henry Mountains. Uh, not too far from Capitol Reef, right in the middle. This time of year, the deer, the mule deer are in the rut and they're real dumb. And so the big ones are coming out chasing does. And we're gonna go check them out and video them for a little bit. And just get outside and enjoy the great outdoors and a beautiful, Freezing, freezing cold morning, but we'll be okay. This girl, I'll be back. I'm gonna hop off chasing that dove. Yeah. Hugs is gonna be like, oh yeah, you're lucky. I don't have my cub. It's not season. Tracks are there. Oh, there's a deer track. Oh man, this is freaking heaven right here. That same buck that we oh, first pulled up that four pole. No, that is not the same four pole. Oh my gosh! Fox, you see that buck? Oh my! Hey, Hux, come here. I got him in here. He's crabby on the left. See him shaking his horns. 
this is how it was like five years ago when we came down. You just be sitting here. And then he looks like an elk. There's a buck over here. There's a buck over here. Dude, that guy looks like See, an Look how white he is. There's a white And he's just chasing that little doe. Well, I don't know. This buck over here is bass with Diddy. Giant one. Is that the giant one that you think you've seen, Hawks? Mm -hmm. That's a 190 inch, 200 inch deer. I think so. Yeah. Here we go. You want to go look at that big, big one? Yeah. Right there. Yeah. I want to tag down here. If we had a tag right now, I'd be peeing my pants. Maybe seven or eight. So that's what that goes to show you what genetics do. That deer needs to be pumping it in every one of these does. Yeah, this guy. You got this one over here. He's just hiding. He's waiting for the seconds. I want to turn. I still can't get a look at this one down here. How about that one? He's just gonna cross right in front of it. That's a, see that? Hey, that's a management buck. See, he's a four by three. Yeah. No, he's a four by four. Do you see that? But that's a bad genetic deer too. He's old, crabby. Seeing a glance of a horn. The one that the deer just pushed. His head's in the trees. Huh? Oh, there's the double cheater. How about that? And then there's a bunch down in the open, down in the flat. There's four. Over to the left. Oh, I see. Where'd he go? You can see his horns. See his horns? Yeah. Touch it. Mine are 
we've had a great day. We uh, woke up super early, went and found oof, two deer for sure at 200 inches, one that was well over 200, and then probably eight that were at the 170, 180 range. Got up in the snow, got real cold. Crew, Dax, and Hux are a little bit chilly and we're gonna gather some more firewood and we've got a couple miles back to camp have big fire lunch and i hope to have a siesta um they're just better when you're out in the wilderness Every time I come on a trip with Casey, I get designated chef, right? Pack trip, horse ride, whatever. I thought that was it. But I agree. I agreed upon it. I like cooking. He's the best. I like cooking. By far, the best Dutch ovens over a fire. Fun, so I can't complain. I got to earn my keep. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, just got back from an amazing night, or amazing day of uh, looking at monster muleys. We are down on the Henry's, fun day, looking at deer, getting ready to put a tri-tip on the tailgater Traeger here. Thanks to Polaris, we're going to have a great dinner and a warm trailer because it's freaking cold. Way cold. But, fun time, we got Daxton and who's 12 or 13, 14. Huxon is eight, crew is 10, and these boys are awesome. We let them shoot for quite a while today. It's fun to get out and show them, showing them what life's really about. Getting out, going on an adventure, and not knowing where you're going, the fear of that, and getting over it, and then maybe getting stuck, maybe driving off the edge mostly because someone's foot was in the way. But just, it's important as a father to get out here and show my boy all the fun stuff about life and the outdoors. It was a dang good day. We're gonna have a dang good dinner. I'll let you know how it all is here in a little bit when we get tucked in for bed. But another good day tomorrow. All right, Dad. You go take your coat and your brace off. Get in here. Ooh, look at that. Day two, looking for deer in the rut. Great day yesterday, great dinner. The tri-tip was potatoes. Blake, camp cook back here. He's got breakfast going. Pancakes, bacon, and eggs this morning. And then we're gonna go see a few deer, let these boys shoot for a little while, and head back north home. And then have almost a little over a week home and then head to the NFR. Go sign some autographs and then hopefully it's winter and it's time to snowmobile. Today was fun, or yesterday was fun too because we got up in the snow. Wishing I would have brought my snowmobile. It was probably a foot to 14 inches. It was kind of fun to go play in. But we'll eat breakfast and then see you on the mountain. Someone's gonna be happy when they pull up and there's already firewood here for them. Yeah. No. 
Those are not deer. No? No. False alarm. False alarm. Now we can kind of see it. See, do you know where we were? You see where we were? One ear plug. Um, found a good place to shoot. Let Hux and these boys do a little target practice and uh, have a little fun for a couple hours before we head home. That's the plan. Through the scope, and I'll show you what I'm looking at. You see that stick laying down? Okay. That's what I want you to shoot. Yeah, you got more. Hit that yellow one, bud. I want to see you. Hit that log. Yeah. Okay, I'm watching you. Hit the left side of the stick, of the log. Finished our little getaway for the weekend. Fun time, great time. Sunday morning, 11.30, should be home right at dark. It's a beautiful drive home. We made a lot of fun memories. We did some shooting, seen some awesome deer. No coyotes, not one rabbit. Blew me away. But all together, fun trip and we stayed warm. Plenty cold. But, great time, Southern Utah, thank you very much. <laughs>